what is up you guys welcome back to my channel this is your friend Tarshal and yes today we're back again for another ukulele tutorial and uh, for today's video I'm with Luca my kitten my five months old kitten <laughs> oh wow oh, okay and um, yeah and for today we're gonna learn she by Sam it's an OPM song and before we get into the video and if you're new to my channel please don't forget to oh hold on hold on okay there you go and if you're new to my channel please don't forget to click that subscribe and below and always ring the bell so that you will be notified for videos just like this and um, yeah please go ahead and grab your ukulele and I'm gonna grab mine Here's my ukulele for today. It's a DMD ukulele. It's actually my second ukulele that I'm always using in my video. So, yeah. And please tune into the standard tuning that's G, C, E, and A. It should sound like this. Okay. So, the song is so chill and it's so easy, so it's really good for beginners. And we're gonna need four songs for the song. The strumming pattern is excellent, very easy as well. So, let's start with the chords. Now, for the song, we'll only need chords let's start with the first chord and that's chord of F all you need to do is to place your index finger on the first fret second string and middle finger on the second fret fourth string and it should sound like this next chord here is a chord of C and that's single string chord all you need to do is to place any of your finger on the third fret first string it should sound like this my favorite chord to the C is for carousel. Next chord here is the chord of G. All you need to do is to place your index finger on second fret third string, middle finger on the second fret first string, and the ring finger on the second fret second third fret second string. Sorry, and it should sound like this. And the last chord here is A minor. That's another single string chord. All you need to do is to place any of your finger on the second fret fourth string, and it should sound like this. Okay, so let's head on to the chord progression. So for our verses, we're gonna need this chord, F, and then the chord of C. So you're gonna repeat it three times, and then, and then for the last part of the verses, you're gonna have the chord of F, then G, and C. That's it. Then that will actually be the same for the pre-chorus, so pre-chorus uh, three, um, F and F and C, you're gonna repeat that three times. And then, but well, not that kind of strumming, okay? And then for the last line for the pre chorus, we're gonna have F, G, and C. Now for our intro and instrumental, we have F, C, and G, and C. Okay? And for our chorus, we're gonna repeat the F, C again um, twice. And then C, and then F, and then C, and then we're gonna have F, A minor, G, and C. So that's the chord progression. Now let's move on to the strumming pattern. Okay, so now we are already in the strumming pattern part. So again, take note that this is going to be very beginner friendly. So I'm not gonna teach you plucking or everything else on earth. I'm just gonna teach you how to strum and just strum and strum. Okay, uh, so in this song, there are only two strumming patterns. One is for the intro and instrumental, and the other one is for the verse, the pre-chorus, and the chorus. So let's start with the intro. You have the option to just strum down like once or twice. And that's it. See how easy it is, okay? So for example, let's have the instrumental. La, 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 or you can strum twice so it's up to you if you want to strum once or twice okay all right so now let's move on to verses chorus and pre-chorus so for this one you're gonna need just one strumming pattern this is the easiest one down down up up down up down that is before you switch to a different chord down Down, down, up, up, down, up, down, up, down. So 
that's only for chords F and um, F and um, C. But, okay, so you remember that on the last line of the verse and the pre-chorus, you have the F and then you need to switch to G and A, uh, C, right? So this is how it should sound like. So it's going to be like a cut of your strumming pattern. So for F, like down, down, up, and then switch to G directly, down, down, up, and then C, down, down, up, up, down, up, down. It should sound like this. And you need to cut your strumming pattern um, the full strumming pattern and yeah I think that's it so yeah I think we're ready to sing the song together so hurry up and um, sing with me that was weird oh and one more thing before we move on I would like to promote my friend um, he's also a youtuber um, we share the same city which I'm living currently living right now his name's Ryan Lagan and if you're new and if you haven't subscribed yet to his channel please do so I'll just provide a link on the description box below and um, please say hi to me on his comment sections okay If you're new to my channel and if you haven't liked and subscribed so please do so please like share and subscribe this video to your friends and family and i'll see you on my next video